very nice because you know it's a braid right there looking all Pocahontas-esque. Why don't you have braids in your hair? I used to have braids and then what had happened was it was a, uh, a major scissor accident and a barber he just took it all off so I stuck with this. Yeah, yeah. It's unfortunate but it was fortunate. So I have to ask you, you're in Let It Shine. I was so sad to not see you on the set because we did fly out and visit. What is your character name? King of the Bling? Bling. He, he's got three names. I'm like P. Diddy. It's the Bling, Lord of the Bling, Bling, and then Bling, Bling. So it's, 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 it's three different names. Actually, that's four. Technically, five if you Bling, Bling it. What if you Bling, Bling, Bling? I mean, if you Bling, 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 then I might have to cry, 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 because that's a little excessive. <laughs> How does Lord of the Bling fit in to let it shine? Well, the storyline. Lord of the Bling, aka Bling, is 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 basically the king of, of, of this rap scene in Atlanta, you know, where this film takes place. He's won the Grand Slam champion every year in a row. He might bust a rhyme right now. His rhyme's so nice, he might even make 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 rice into I don't know. But he gets off, you know? And basically he plays the character who's in your face who thinks he's too cool for school, who thinks he's the best in town, and uh, he has to face a harsh reality. And that's the reality that you'll see in Let It Shine. And he gets involved with the love triangle between Coco Jones, Tyler James Williams, and Trevor Jackson. And he makes things just a lot more difficult for people to coincide and get along. But at the end of the day, he's a talented rapper and he's a force to be reckoned with. Yeah, I know there's obviously singing, rapping. There's also some dance choreography. Did you get your hand in that? You know what? I did. I, I was luckily able to watch a lot of the dance choreography. Trevor Jackson is an amazing artist. I feel like he's going to be the next, you know, Chris Brown with his moves, the next Whoa. Michael Jackson. I mean, his moves are superior. He's doing aerial flips. I believe Coco Jones is going to be the next Beyonce. I mean, it's a cast to be reckoned with, and it was great to see everybody put in their own little piece in the pot. And this is a great Let It Shine gumbo. Yeah. I want some of that gumbo. You better get some of that gumbo. Well, we can all get it soon, because it's right. going to be on the Disney Just Channel. Just make sure you have it with a little rice. Okay. Let It Shine gumbo with a little rice, and you'll be all right. And of course, we can all tune in very soon. Why should we all tune in? Well, you should tune in, because this is a film that's going to have you putting your popcorn to the left, so you can groove to the right. Do I need to say more? Let it shine, June 15th. It's out of sight. It's, it's, it's going to be a momentous occasion. <laughs>